Friedrich states that the quality of national road infrastructure in the Karas region is still regarded as one of the finest in the country. Furthermore, she notes that Namibian roads are among the top ranked in Africa. However, despite these achievements, she points out that the heavy rainfall experienced in the region constantly causes significant damage to various sections of gravel roads. There is also a need that that, that should be fast-tracked to upgrade because um, um, was it last year we have heavy rains then access of um, of services to these communities becomes a challenge because of the roads that are washed away and people cannot travel it. MPs will also engage in meetings with various stakeholders in the region. Additionally, they have planned meetings with officials from the Ministry of Works and Transport to address the challenges they encounter in terms of road construction and maintenance. Our committee, as the name indicated, that is responsible for transport, infrastructure, housing. Then now we are access and familiar ourselves how those areas, I mentioned areas, connected to the very good national roads so that all our Namibians have an access. We want to make sure that we access and we know where is those and we are going to compile a very good reports to our houses after its adoptions, then it's going to be an asset for the executive to for implementations. The oversight committees in the region to acquaint itself with the state of roads, network connectivity and accessibility to schools and health facilities in rural areas. Na Tangwajimi NBC News, Kiet Manswap.